Hello and welcome back to the Brick Den. Today I have the second and final update for my first order communications base on Mon Cala Mock. If you missed the first update and you'd like to watch that first, you can find a link in the description and there'll also be one in the cards as well. Also, stay tuned until the end of the video to see the complete mock. But first of all, we are starting this update with the progress I've made to the pillars that are going to suspend the base. At the moment though, they are quite under detailed but I have built more of them since the last update. To finish them off, like I said in the last update, I've ordered a brick. So here is the brick link. Now the main reason to get this was to finish off and make the pillars much more sleek and curved. So you can see I did get some leaf pieces as I'm always short of them. I did also get some other bits to make my base more detailed and detailing in general. And then finally I got these pieces to curve the edges of the pillars. Now I also did get another brick link here. And in this brick link I just got some Mon Calamari head pieces to make it seem more authentic that this was Mon Cala. So you can now see the completely finished pillars. I've tried to make them as detailed as possible and still make sure that they're sturdy so they'll be able to hold up the base. This section up here where the two Technic pins are is where the main body of the base will latch onto. I use these specific pins so the base can be easily removed from the pillars so I don't have to leave the base hanging constantly. So now that all the parts are fully built and just about finished, it's time to assemble the whole mock together. Now it's a bit of a risk because I'm not quite sure if it's going to actually be able to hold the base, the three pillars, but hopefully it's going to work and for that I'm going to need some help so I've got the mini builder to help me. So, are you ready, Mini Builder? Yes. Here it is, the first order communications base on Mon Cala completely finished and suspended over the vast ocean planet by the three pillars. However, I don't really trust they'll be able to hold it up over a long period of time, so most of the time I have it propped up by the picker brick cups underneath the main base. But now that the mock is all together and complete, you can see the progress I have made to the main body of the base. You can see the roof is a lot more detailed than it was previously. Not only is there now a walkway for stormtroopers, there is also lots of satellite dishes. I did decide to use some of them from Decor and just to tweak them or leave them exactly the same because I was very happy with what I built for that mock and the solutions I came up with. So I didn't really think there was any point completely rebuilding them and pretty much building the same thing all over again. I've also built the pod that allows stormtroopers to enter the base Unfortunately, it is quite small and only fits one minifigure at a time. The motor for the winch is up here on the roof. There is also an IR receiver which I think blends in quite well to the exterior, the base. The winch can be controlled by this remote which also controls its speed. So that is all the progress I've made for this update. So now that the mock is is finished a mock showcase will come out very soon which will show a detailed look at all the areas of this mock not just what i've covered in this video but for now the brick den also has an instagram account which if you're interested you'll find a link in the description for that also if you enjoyed this video don't forget to leave a like and also subscribe but most of all thank you so much for watching